Hey, in this video, I'm going to be giving a tip for users of the Ikai MPK Mini. This is the MPK Mini 3. And what I found was that the keypad was very, very soft, that you had to hit the notes or hit the keys very hard to get the notes louder in terms of MIDI velocity. But what I found is that if you hold this button, the full control, if you hold it down, you can access like a hidden menu. And in this hidden menu, you have V1, V2, V3, V4, and then black balance. If you adjust K2, that will adjust the V2. And the starting thing for V2 is six, which I think is way too soft. So by increasing that to 10, or some people might even prefer 12, but I found 10 is good. That means that when I play these notes using virtual instruments, they're, it, it feels much more natural to me. I'm not having to like hammer the keys. The V1, V3 and V4 adjust the sort of the lower end of the MIDI velocity. So I think V1 is from zero to 64. V2 is from 64 to 87. V3 is from, you know, et cetera, et cetera, going upwards. Then the black balance is for adjusting the balance between the black and the white keys. In my case, the, the black keys are white and the white keys are black. And then in order to save that, all you have to do is hold in the full control again and it will switch back to just the regular menu. And you're done. And this just makes the whole keyboard much, much more usable in terms of the velocity. So hopefully somebody find this video helpful and I will be back with more videos soon. Cheers.